Hello and welcome to another review on my channel. My name is Arthur Brehm and I am the Teutonic Gerhard. Well, I'm from Cologne, Germany and I'd like to show you one of my favorite knives. It's the Frank Centofante 3. The Spadaco Centofante 3. Fiber glass reinforced nylon blade VG10. Overall length of this knife 19.2 centimeters. The blade has 7.9 centimeters with a thickness of 2 millimeters. The knife weighs 71 gram, which is 2.5 ounces. Well, um, Frank Centofante was um, 40 years a knife maker in the United States and he was um, the president of the Knife Makers Guild of America and um, unfortunately he passed away. And this is the last collaboration between Centofante and um, Spiderco. So they made this... Um, yeah, elegant. Um, they say it's an it's a gentleman's knife, and I agree with that. Um, has a beautiful hollow crown, and the typical spider hole. Um, by the way, there are no liners in this model. Don't know why. It's pure. FRN, no liners, and it's a backlog. So um, they say it's a it's a gentleman's knife. Um, here in Germany, you are not allowed uh, to carry this knife legally in um, in the public. You will be will, you will get in trouble just because of one hand opening and locking knife. If this would have um, like a Victorinox um, slip joint, you would have to carry it uh, legally in public, but so um, you get in trouble if you will be catched and uh, by the police. And um, yeah, the knife um, at this time we have um, Christmas time in. in 2015 and the knife I I checked the the price um, at um, Amazon and it was 123 euros um, which is okay for my taste it's not too expensive but it's not a cheap knife so um, in case of or uh, uh, just because of the blade um, it's a lightweight knife. You can carry it um, very good hidden in your in your pocket. The pocket clip is a standard Victorinox. Victorinox, sorry, <laughs> it's a standard Spiderco um, pocket clip, which will yeah you, you can see which will be. Shown um, that um, that the knife was carried by the owner, yeah. And um, but I don't care. It's um, it's just the way it is with um, with colored uh, clips. It's a pin construction, which I don't like really that much. Um, Maybe it would have been better they used uh, a screws. Um, yeah. Oh, by the way, um, I don't know uh, if I, I, uh, I told you the knife thickness is two millimeters. Um, so it makes a good slicer. 
came sharp out of the box um, as already known by all spider -Cos. I never had a spider co which was dull or nearly dull I ever had sharp knives out of the box from spider co so for a quick size comparison I show you my old old and dirty Endura 4 my Old and dirty Delica for so these are classic spider coats and I think um, if the price would have been under 100 euros this um, could have been um, yeah a truly classic spider co uh, by the way this um, insert in the handle is uh, palladium silver as far as I know yeah. um, everybody knows the Endura and the Delica they are timeless classic spider coats and as I said this could have been um, yeah this could have been um, a classic spider co if it um, would be a little bit cheaper under 100 euros great knife oh city city japan you can see great knife plate cent um, centering is uh, top yeah. and um, yeah love that knife and even um, if it's not allowed to carry it in public in here in Germany uh, pst, I don't care I don't give a shit um, so most of the time I carry I carry two knives with me one knife is a one hand opening blade and the main knife for the public is most of the time uh, Victorinox so here the model climber and here my very first knife the very old school Spartan without uh, toothpick and tweezers and um, I don't know what the name for that is um, for the split ring um, this was bought by my grandpa in 1970 on uh, 31st of December um, New Year's Eve for my birthday so this knife was well, my first knife oh that's another story I told I tell you another day um, so this the Santo Fante and and um, Whatever you carry, a Swiss Army knife is, uh, um, is a good choice. So these two are a good and beautiful pair, and I love them to carry. And yeah, I thank you very much for watching. Please check out my German um, channel in German language. Um, it's. Uh, a gear channel in German gear outdoor bushcraft survival prepping and so on under my real name Arthur Brehm um, I will put down uh, the link down in in the description box and um, yeah gives me a thumbs up um, maybe thumbs down and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching take care and I Hope you all have a great day. Bye-bye.